Thanks. See an increase in the number of people reaching out for help after Hurricane Francine. Sabrina Wilson has more on the help that's available now and what the state says about disaster food stamps. Even before Hurricane Francine roared ashore in South Louisiana, Second Harvest Food Bank was busy helping people in advance of the storm. For so many people across South Louisiana, uh, we saw First of all, people getting ready in Lafayette where we helped them set up a shelter there and worked with the fire department to make sure that people that were unhoused had access to food. Um, then the storm came through and so many people did not have power and so they couldn't cook and we were called upon to do meals. And now the number of meals Second Harvest has distributed is over 200,000 pounds, says its president and CEO, Natalie Jaro. Long after the storm is gone, we not only have to give them the meals um, to eat while the power is out, but there's also the groceries to replace afterwards. And we've distributed about 240,000 pounds of food, but there's a lot more to come, particularly in our bayou area. She says families were already having a hard time putting food on the table before Francine. But as we all know, inflation picked up where COVID left off. So we had a lot of folks in need. We've seen an increase to one out of every six Louisianans that are at risk for hunger. Um, one out of every four of our kids. So far, the presidential major disaster declaration covers these eight parishes. However, Louisiana's Department of Children and Family Services says the Disaster Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program, or DSNAP, has not yet been authorized, but it's working to submit a request for DSNAP operation in those eight parishes to the USDA. Still, even if you're not in one of those eight parishes, FEMA says document your damage because your area could eventually be added to the president's disaster declaration. But if you have pictures, good, great, save them. And then in the event that an additional parish or additional parishes are brought into the, uh, the presidential declaration, then you know, by all means, file that claim with your insurance company and then uh, go ahead and apply for federal assistance. Second Harvest is still helping victims of Hurricane Laura, a storm that hit Louisiana in 2020. Disaster doesn't end for us. We're still responding in Lake Charles to Hurricane Laura. Those folks have been without uh, for, what is that, four years now, three, four years? The city of Kenner says, according to the director of its food, Bank phones are running off the hook now. J. Rowe says Kenner's Food Bank is one of their partner agencies. Of course, Second Harvest welcomes donations. You'll find information on its website, Meg.